So today we are covering two questions which occur a tremendous amount in my coaching sessions. So the first one is how far away you should be stood from the ball. The second one is what is the most common error that creates you to shank that golf ball. So both of them are quite closely connected. So welcome to Mark Amy Golf. Let's get those questions answered, shall we? As I said, the two questions are closely connected. So we're going to get the answers in, together in one hit. So first of all is how far away should you be stood from the golf ball? So this one's quite straightforward. So you get yourself set to the golf ball. This, this is an eight iron, so if I'm in my posture position and you draw a line from the butt of the club down towards my feet, it should be just sitting on the edge of the toes close to the end of the shoe. So that is your distance away from the golf ball. So that answers question number one. Question number two, what's the most common bit where you shank it? It's generally when people are stood too far away from the golf ball and then they drive into it to get back to that ball. So that's what you call an early extension. So when you're stood too far away from it, as you can see now, the butt of the club is outside the shoe line. So when you swing back, you've got to get to that ball and then you're forward thrust into it lose power and generally the ball will then move from its starting position into the hosel and cause that shank. Now most amateurs stand too far away. It's better to be stood too close. That will help you achieve a much better dynamic posture. So the idea of the being slightly too close then will encourage you then to get the butt back as in your glutes, back away from the ball, your chest down so more open to the target, which is a much better dynamic posture, and then create a much better strike, more in the centre of the club, a more consistent, powerful shot. As you can see, there's some quite big, famous quotes in the screen from some top players in the game and coaches. So when you have got those shanks, please, if we refer to Newton's third law, as you can see in the screen now, it's a game of opposites. So get slightly closer to it and drive away from the ball, get that chest down. I've done a video on early extensions. I'll put the link in the screen so then you can click on that and check that one out. So any questions or comments on that, please send them through. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Add any comments, any questions pinging through, and I'll see you soon.